Hi everyone, it's Cassie Cassie. How are you all? Hey, I miss you all. I tried to put up some work yesterday, but post some pictures to let you all know that I was coming back, but it just would not work. There's a lot of things you can do and you can't do with YouTube, I'm finding out. I've had my channel for a while, but I did not utilize it like I'm doing now so I'm finding out a lot if I would have took that time you know a few years ago I would have been well on my way but I'm still on my way but um yes so here I am today I love you all I miss secret day Thursday guess what I have something to tell you I don't know if it's a secret but I surely didn't want a whole lot of people knowing about it when it first happened or when I first did it. And now I feel sort of honored to say that I had it done because of how it turned out, how it's been for me. I'm going to post the picture, but guess what? Guess what? I used to weigh close to 300 pounds. I did. With my medical condition, with my feet, made it so impossible for me to move around and exercise. And then I had gained so much weight, so much weight. I ended up getting gastric bypass surgery in 2015 and it's been it's been four years going on five years and I've only gained about I fluctuate from 10 to 20 pounds yes okay I started out at 200 guess what 258 pounds So yeah, I fluctuate from about anywhere from 10 to 20 pounds, you know, but I go from like 137 to like 147. And then you know what, for me, what really makes it easy is because I could lose the weight so fast. It's like losing weight is not really a challenge for me anymore. If I put my mind to it, and in like two weeks, I can be down to like 110 pounds. And that's just eating like healthy, fatty things like avocados and a little, um, a lot of mayonnaise here and there, a lot of butter here and there. And um, it changed my life, actually. I did not know that I was going to get that much attention from it when I first had the surgery. But when I lost the surgery, I would go places and people would say, oh, you look like somebody I used to know. They did. They would say, you look like somebody I used to know. And they would, you know, would say, what, what is your name? And I'll tell them my name and we'll go through that whole little, little conversation. I just let them go ahead and just vent to me. And then I say, it is me. It's me. It's me. Just all start screaming and smiling. Oh my goodness, a total different person. It's like 140, 41 pounds, 147 pounds to be exact. Like about 147 to 41 pounds I lost. 141 pounds, we'll say. I lost. I know. I know. I could. Oh my gosh, that first year I lost, the first year I lost everything in that first year. And probably within nine months, I lost everything. I got down to like, um, the record 110, but then I had to gain a little weight. I was too excited. <laughs> but then um, I began to like balance, balance, balance. 
what I eat and how I used to eat, it was difficult because I really love food. And you guys know I really love sweets. And I do. And I still to this day have to have a little bit around me, a lot around me. That way I won't eat it. But if I don't have it, I, I will want to eat it, try it. So that's my take on it. Well, something I have to do to keep my weight down. But 140 one pound wow when i really lost all the weight the first I, of course i had to buy all new clothes yes i had to i had to purchase everything new even my shoes i couldn't even wear my shoes anymore they were too big so so i went from wearing a size 24 to a size zero zero and now i'm like in a size two, three, depending on who makes it, and pants, and a size small between a X small and a small top, depending on where I'm at during the, the, you know, the season, the year. But for so far, I've managed to keep it all off. Um, I went to all my classes, and I remember the doctor telling me that if I wanted to, wanted my weight loss to be a success that I would have to um, continue to eat like I'm eating to lose the weight. Like I had to change my whole lifestyle, everything about how I was eating the food, how long I was chewing the food, all of that changed. Um, so once I learned that and learned my portions, you know, I only get a Two, two slices of oranges or maybe three of the little cuties. That's about it. Um, and then I could probably just mash up the rest for juice. But on one setting, that's it. Um, I could do like a half an egg. That's it. And if I want to try something different, I do like um, a half ounce of, of, of cheese. But not the same time as I eat the egg. So I, I would do that. And I would do only about um, an ounce of meat. No more than a half ounce of ounce of meat. I probably would equal about two spoonfuls. Two teaspoons. Not not tablespoon. Teaspoon. And um, I'm still true and try to the, stick to the drinks after you eat. So I try to do that so, so much. I try. But it's a little difficult. I'm still mastering it, but it's better than what it used to be. Um, I used to get my feelings hurt when I couldn't eat a whole lot. But then when I saw the results, I was so happy. So it, it just balanced out so like beautifully. Um, yeah. Um, the only thing that I thought would be miracle changing for me in having the weight loss surgery was I thought I wasn't gonna be in any more pain anymore I thought that that would solve my joint pain and that that would be it I'd be the smaller I get the better I'll feel but that didn't change what did change was me not being so heavy on my feet and it just being so you know difficult so that that changed and that was like really um something good um what else i can go in the stores and find anything just about to wear and i can always get so close i can always buy them on sale that's what i love about it so much I could buy it on sale. So, I might go in there and see a dress that I really wanted when I was heavier. And I just really didn't want to get it. It's just too expensive. And it's like $10 more you heavier you are. And size 24, they usually don't have it. And it's just, a, it's just a lot. It was just a lot. But when I lost all the weight... Oh my goodness, those same dresses that I used to want, I just went and had to go, I went and got a couple and had to alter, I had to alter most of my clothing 
especially the pants because they when I lost weight everything was just like it was just like um how can I say it was just like cut different like 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 they were gonna still fall off even though they were on me so yes I had to find a balance to you know I'm still I'm still getting to that balance though because I'm still like oh I want to be 110 pounds like I was when I was at my thinnest and to me I felt good and I was so good I was like so happy so happy but everybody around me were like you're gonna you you're not well you are not well you need to gain some weight you need to go eat a couple cheeseburgers they would tell me this and I thought it was so funny because I'm thinking oh I'm still like really heavy no baby I was so small so I don't really want to get back to like 110 pounds but I have settled on 117 pounds. That was pretty good weight. So, so there I am. Here I am. Uh, so, how much do I have to lose now to get back there? Because it's been the winter time. And it's been a little difficult because of my feet and not being able to move around like I want to. So, a lot of things are in factor because of my weight gain. You want me to tell you? One, three, seven. And I'm probably like one, three, eight, or nine. <laughs> so I got about 17 more pounds to go. I don't have to, but that's just me. That's just what I would like to like stay at that was such a good weight I was at a size one pants and it was just so nice I didn't feel heavy or dragged down because when I gained my weight back I gained it in my hips and arms I mean you can't really see right now but my arms oh my goodness that's my arm but mm -mm. in my hips and Guys, oh my goodness, they're like just like super. But so I'm trying to like work on that. And um, hopefully I'm coming up on five years since I had the surgery. And that's all I've gained back. So I'm just very thankful to God that, hey, that's, that's it. That is it. And so my eating, I, I do, I did share with you guys what I eat. But I'm going to start sharing a little bit more on how I what I eat, eat still and yes does it break my heart to eat a little bit sometimes because I be like greedy yeah greedy and I found foods that I can eat a lot of and some days I take advantage of that but I have to pay for it because it won't stay down mm -mm. it won't stay down it'll just and it makes me feel so sick but okay so I'm gonna let you guys you know see as I go on but not not right now <laughs> but I'm gonna let you see I'm gonna do some follow-up pictures this week so you all can see but thank you for tuning into my channel it's Cassie Cassie I love you guys and thank you all for supporting me if you have not subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button leave some comments share me and I'll see you next time okay peace Love you all. Mwah.